10 local school districts are looking for substitute teachers. Some schools are even looking to fill full-time positions. Well, today, prospective candidates got one-on-one -on -one time with some superintendents and principals telling them why they're qualified for the job. 27 First News weekend anchor Julie Bursick is live in the studio with that story. Yeah, Austintown, Canfield, Poland, even Struthers were at today's job fair, and this was a chance for the schools to meet prospective new hires, but it was also a chance for recent grads to network with a potential boss. Dominique Matteritz is looking to land her first teaching job. She's meeting with Austin Town Schools. It went really great with Austin Town. I learned about some possible positions coming up, so I'm glad I came and was able to get that front-to-front -front face with both of them. Dominique also interviewed with Struthers, Poland, and Canfield. She came ready to, with a binder of information, even lesson plans. Just to kind of see how I write lesson plans, how I kind of include the detail, how I differentiate in the classroom. And then I do have some pictures from when I was in the different classrooms, just showing my hands on learning. Lisa Matthews is a recent education graduate. She also got to talk with superintendents and principals today. It's definitely a very different experience. Some schools have openings. Others are looking for substitute teachers. Subbing opportunities range from daily to short term, even long term. Subs need to have a bachelor's degree, but it does not have to be in education. And then you can apply through ODE, which is the Ohio Department of Education, to get a substitute teacher's license. Now, that doesn't qualify you to become a regular classroom teacher, but it uh, does give you the opportunity to substitute. Dominique says she's open to being a sub, but she really wants to land her first teaching job. So if you're interested in becoming a substitute teacher, but you couldn't make it to today's job fair, here's what you need to know. You can start that application process on rachelwixie.com. But you can also call the Mahoning Valley Regional Council of Governments. We have both of those website informations linked for you on our website, wkbn.com. Reporting in the studio, Julie Bursick, WKBN 27 First News at 5.